Uh, John, going into a game against Walsall, and clearly you're on a fantastic run. It must be bouncing at the moment. No, it is. Listen, it, it's been you know a brilliant couple of weeks. Um, we do feel the star. I keep saying it. You know, the performances have been there. Uh, prior to the wins, but the boys have been getting the rewards. But again, you don't only get your rewards if you work hard, and it's going to be no different come Saturday against a, a very good Walsall team who haven't got the results you know that that we've seen of late um, on the analysis. So uh, it'll be a tough game. It will be because you know coming down the division and still trying to find the feet early part of the season. Um, we've got some really good players, and we'll have to be mindful of that. Um, we talk. We talk about obviously you're, you're in good form at the moment, and performances are now gleaning the results but you're doing that as well we're having to have had made changes across probably all the games I think yeah well we've, we've got that squad we've, we've got the depth we, we've utilised the, the 23s we all know that the remit this year and directed this year is to introduce more of the um, the academy boys into the first team and I think you, you've seen that from what we've done um, your Hassan Ali's your Noah Chilvers your Ken Stales, your Kawami Pokus, just to mention a few really uh, in the first month. So, yeah, we're, we're looking to introduce that, but then also I think we've had a couple of injuries where, you know, we, we could have done without, obviously, um, but good to see Paris back midweek. Uh, Theo's come back into it, you know, he'll give that competitive edge up top as well. Um, so, yeah, it, it's, it's been good on that front that the, the game the other night was an excellent game for us, a really competitive game. And game time for boys that needed the minutes, which was excellent.